Hey everyone, welcome to my channel, Tiny and Tidy. I'm Vishali and I am determined to motivate you to get your messy, disorganized space nice and tidy. Oh no, I just started and it looks like Josh is already up from his nap, so I'm just gonna go grab him and I'll be right back. All right, we're back. Uh, so if you're new here, this is baby Josh and he is one of my three kids. All right, so let's get right back into it. I'm often asked how I managed to find time to slap on some makeup and look pretty decent with three kids. Well, it took some time to figure it out, but now I have a system that works. If you wanna know how to look good in less time, then keep on watching. Often when we become moms, we dedicate all of our time to our kids um, and we start to neglect ourselves. But I don't think we should have to do that. All it takes is a little bit of planning and we will be able to find a small window to make sure that we also look good. Today, I'll be sharing five tips that will help you look better in less time. But before I get into that, I just wanted to remind you to hit that big red subscribe button down below because I'll be posting a useful video just like this one every single week. All right, so let's get into tip number one, manicures. I rarely have time to go to the nail salon anymore, but I still manage to have beautiful nails. So how do I do it? Press on nails. These take less than 10 minutes to apply and they last for an entire week. A box of them costs around $8 and I can get two sets from one box. That's without even using the accent nails. And I don't like using accent nails because I think that makes it look more obvious that they're fake. Um, I also prefer a more basic, simplistic style when it comes to anything and everything. In order for me to be able to get two uses from one box, I do have to save the pinky nails after I've used them once. Uh, the box comes with only one pair in that tiny size, so I do have to reuse them. As for the other nails, I can find multiples that fit. The pinky nail barely gets damaged within a week, so you will be able to reuse it if you also have tiny pinky nails like I do. The brand I use are called Impress and I've linked them in the description box down below. They are so easy to apply and I often just do them in the car while my husband is driving if I don't have time to do them at home. I also carry a small bottle of nail glue in my purse uh, in case one of them pops off, which can happen as you get closer to the end of the week. You can get them wet, you can clean, you can do the dishes with them on and they won't fall off. By the end of the week, they'll easily come off and won't damage your nails. Now let's move on to tip number two, pedicures. I can usually make it to the nail salon about once a month, maybe once a month and a half, and what I've started doing is getting shellac pedicures instead of regular ones. I know that regular pedicures usually last and rarely chip, but shellac ones look so much better over time. I find that regular pedicures start to look dull, whereas shellac ones will look shiny until you remove the polish. And it's highly unlikely that they'll chip. Tip number three, hair. When it comes to hairstyles, I say figure out your go-to hairstyle and just do that every day, especially when you're in a rush. Don't waste time trying to figure out a new hairstyle all the time. It'll only slow you down if your goal is to look good in less time. All right, so Josh has eaten, he has played, and now he is napping, so I can get right back into it. Tip number four is makeup. I know not everyone is into makeup, but if you are, I highly recommend figuring out your go-to everyday makeup look. I learned how to do my makeup by simply watching YouTubers. Find a YouTuber that's the same skin tone as you are and binge watch a bunch of their videos. You will learn so many tips from them. If you're close to my skin tone, which is an NC42 at MAC, I suggest you check out Arshia, Sharifa, Ready to Glow, or Anchal. I'll link all of them in the description box down below. I've learned so much from all of them. For example, I think it was Anchal who shared a very useful tip about highly pigmented eyelids. She said to use it to your advantage and simply don't wear eyeshadow. Since they're so pigmented, it'll look like eyeshadow. So I have very pigmented eyelids and always spent so much time applying eyeshadow to cover this up. But thanks to that tip, I rarely waste time applying eyeshadow anymore. And once you find a look that you like, practice it every single day. Don't keep changing your look. This won't save you any time. Instead, master one look and have the makeup and brushes that you need for that look easily accessible. Tip number five is a capsule wardrobe. 
Having a capsule wardrobe saves me so much time. I'm not gonna get into this uh, tip since I already did a video on this. Make sure to check it out if you wanna know how you can save a ton of time when it comes to getting dressed. If you like the tips I shared in this video, follow me on Facebook and Instagram because that's where I share daily tips and tricks all about organization, saving time, and simplifying your life. Next week, I'm going to show you how I keep track of all of my family's activities and how we stay organized. So be sure to subscribe to my channel and hit the notification bell so that you'll be notified when that video is posted. I've been told by many of my followers that when it comes to organizing, they simply don't know where to start. They're overwhelmed and just can't find the time to do it. Well, I'm working on a program called Clear the Clutter that will help you get organized step by step. If you're interested in learning how to organize your entire home, implement organization systems that actually work, learn how to meal plan, create a detailed home maintenance and cleaning schedule, then sign up on the waitlist for my Clear the Clutter program. The link is in the description box down below. And once the program launches, you will be notified and provided more information. Don't forget to hit that like button and share this video with someone that you know would find it useful. And if you like this video, be sure to check out one of these ones. They're full of tips and tricks that will help you get more organized. As always, thanks for watching guys and happy tidying. Bye.